Hello, MGTOW brothers. Uh, just a um, fairly late evening video. It's uh, just after 11 p.m. No people, noise. Perfect time to um, gather one's thoughts and uh, release a video. Something was on my mind with this recent um, Tommy Robinson situation and it sort of ties in with the themes I've been talking about throughout my videos and um, it's uh, struck me more and more as you know we spend time with our fellow brothers in the manosphere and uh, real life that um, we need to continue striving to be true to ourselves, to be true to our beliefs, our convictions, and to have and or deliver, uh, discover and develop the necessary courage to speak our truth. Um, that may sound easy, and in times past it was, but now that um, time drags on and speaking the truth is becoming increasingly a revolutionary act, it is more important to be able to do so and to educate oneself I mean okay we talk about red pills and you know taking red pills and all this kind of stuff all the time however becoming aware opening one's eyes to the truth goes a lot deeper than becoming aware of modern women's nature and relationships and how the modern man is screwed by them and the whole system is um, gonocentric and blah 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 blah, blah. as important as, as all that stuff is becoming aware opening one's eyes goes a lot further and when when every day reality, life, starts to resemble more and more the uh, two iconic books, 1984 by George Orwell and um, Brave New World by Aldous Huxley, there's a fucking problem. And it becomes necessary for each and every man to stand with one's back more erect and arming ourselves with knowledge developing wisdom and awareness for um, not only our own, our own journey as men, our spiritual paths, what have you, but uh, also with the world around us. And, you know, I really, really, really wish that the men who spend so much time and continue to spend so much time releasing video after video, live stream after live stream, dis discussing this same individual who is, as I would say here in Australia, as boring as batshit, To actually let all that crap go and start opening their eyes and releasing some good content, which I know most of these guys are capable of. <laughs> some of their brothers may think I'm giving these men way too much credit, but I like to think um, the best of my fellow brothers until they prove me wrong. And some have. Um, there have been 
some total imbeciles that have come across in the manosphere since my um, well, I suppose becoming more involved with the Mito community for the past few months and um, six months, one year, whatever. Certainly since becoming more active with my own channel and um, you know, there is continues to be a lot of ego mind and you know what guys you know we're way past that there's no time to indulge in that crap okay really need to start looking around opening opening your eyes and realizing that most of what we've been told and what we believe through the mass media is a concerted effort to keep us blind and stupid to what's really going on. Thankfully, there are truly aware and awakened and uh, well-spoken and wise brothers like Savage Reality who re continue to release some really killer videos. Well done, brother. Really good, good stuff. And... Uh, my very amusing brother, Cave Creature. <laughs> uh, just keep doing what you're doing, brother. You, uh, you bring your own sort of brand of um, humour and insight to the manosphere, and it's really needed these days. And um, for me, you know, I mean, people throw the word cuck around a, a lot here lately. And during the past few months, specifically referring to a certain individual. But you know what? In my opinion, the biggest cuck is he who has the opportunity to open his eyes and become aware and to be truly awakened and passes it up in the name of continuing to feed and stoke drama and bullshit and games and all the rest of it. And... Um, you know, a lot of people, I, I suppose, you know, different men are on different levels of development, and that's fine. It just makes it a little bit challenging when you happen upon a live stream and people are talking about, um, you know, some world events, and I cringe at the total level of inaccuracy in some of the comments and um, sentences. Whatever the mass media, especially the American mass media, tells you people, totally disregard it, okay? Um, it has been made aware of that uh, during the past few months, especially with this whole Syria situation, how that um, news, mass media news, uh, indulges in, um, well, blatant and concerted lying. And they're even in the movies now, people, where they have certain people made up to look like certain people they wish them to portray. And in certain situations where, you know, footage or photos are taken... Uh, some of these people are exactly the same group of people, but in different outfits and different makeup and disguises. Um, so, whatever mass media news tells you, there's whole other multifaceted, multi-leveled um, dimensions to the story. Which, you know, unfortunately, these days most people are too impatient and too caught up in their own daily lives to in the grind of daily living to even bother with. And you know what? That's what they're counting on. So, you know, for the love of all that is holy, all that is unholy, all that is good, all that is um, sarcastic... Open your eyes, have the courage to become aware and the courage to speak the truth. 
you want to show what a, what a man you are? Do it where it counts, by speaking the truth. However and wherever you can. Um, there are men like um, Tommy Robinson who actually chose to go to prison. Well, he realised that, that that was going to be the option for um, actually speaking the truth. And hopefully this situation will help other people to become more aware and open their own eyes to that importance. Because when they, when they have silenced us all, guess what? They've won. Metal MGTOW on guitar, out.